In the past two weeks, nearly 70 people, mainly children, have contracted the cholera disease in Kwara State, north central Nigeria. The area mainly affected is Ilori, the state capital. The State Commissioner for Health says his ministry is on top of the situation. It's coming as a surprise. But by and large, because we are in a relay season, we are by flooding do occur into the source of water, into the source of food, or that there are so many fruits around that people can take without proper washing and otherwise. So basically, we believe it's due to a general condition of the people around the locality where the issues occur. A government delegation has been touring health facilities in the state capital, led by the secretary to the state government. Their findings is that the people are at risk mainly due to poor sanitation. We have started a, a sanitization exercise to educate the people of the society to ensure that they keep a clean environment to avoid this type of something. So that's what we have done so far. Health professionals at this primary health care center confirmed that the hospital recorded 67 cases in the last two weeks. She says the staff are trained on how to handle such diseases, aided by a functional treatment center. In the month of May, we've had um, 83 cases, and in the last two weeks, 67 cases in Children's Specialist Hospital. So far, we, we've, we, are, we are enjoying the support of the government, and we will continue to enjoy that, because the, the ministry have promised to even provide us with um, IV fluids, giving sets, and medications. The State Ministry of Health has deployed resources to hospitals across the state to enable them to contain its spread, while there's an ongoing campaign to educate the people to keep the environment clean.